name's Tim Dolan with Power2 Energy Systems, and here at the ARA show we're pleased to be introducing our hybrid energy storage systems. These systems work in conjunction with a diesel generator or other energy sources to provide seamless and silent hybrid power. So this product right here is a 30 kVA with 60 kilowatt hours of storage, and it has three major components that I'm going to walk you through right now. The first component, as with any energy storage system, is obviously the battery. So the whole base of our system is high density lithium ion batteries. And then it comes up with 48 volt DC power from the batteries through our inverters, which is the second major component that translates that voltage from 48 volt DC to 208 volt three phase on the output side. Then the third major component, we'll walk to the front of the system is our onboard controller. This is a bespoke controller built for this system that will control the various different energy sources. So it could be grid, could be solar, could be a generator. It processes that into the battery and then out to the load. Now this system will automatically sense the load and tell the generator when it's needed and when it can be shut off. So at periods of low load, we run primarily from the battery and then we only restart the generator based on two parameters. And that is number one, if the battery reaches 10%, we call the generator to switch on and recharge the battery. Number two, if the load spikes up above what the hybrid is able for, we call for the generator and seamlessly switch over to generator power. At the control panel at the front, we have a very simple two wire connection that goes to the generator. That's the communication method that tells the generator to switch on and off. And inside the door is simple cam lock connections to connect to the generator and then out again to the load. So you can connect via cam lock and then we have bus bar connections if a company prefers to do it with mechanical lugs. Very rugged product, it has a galvanized steel frame so it's built specifically for the rental market. Other than that, um, it eliminates service issues with generators such as wet stacking. Tier 4 final generators are very sensitive to wet stacking and they don't like it and they will actually shut down or go into regen. So by just making sure they run when they need to, we can eliminate that wet stacking and that service problem. So typical applications are uh, construction site applications where you're running a job site trailer and you want power for 24 hours a day to keep security lights, cameras, even heaters on. So at night time the load is very low and by using the hybrid power system, we reduce the reliance on the generator. Uh, tower cranes and construction site elevators are another good application because the generator has to be sized based on the crane lifting its maximum load and slewing at the same time. That results in the generator being sized in a worst case scenario, so it's often very oversized for the job. By implementing the hybrid power system, we can actually either downsize the generator or let the generator run for less hours in the day. Another interesting application is where there's noise ordinances. So the customer needs silent power overnight. We had a recent application where they were using uh, concrete thawing um, or concrete curing devices. And so they need to power them 24 hours a day. And so we were able to power it overnight with the hybrid and just start the generator during the day. Some of the benefits for the, the rental center, primarily we're reducing the hours on the generator. So rather than run the generator 24 hours a day, we're probably cutting that runtime to four hours a day. So many, many, many less hours. That increases the service life of the generator, also increases the resale value of the generator. Um, it also allows the generator company to get revenue that would otherwise be going to the fuel company. So it's burning less fuel, um, so less money is going out on fuel, and you're getting a rental asset on site. So you're getting revenue you would otherwise be missing out on.